Today's Captain's Blog is brought to you by Madman Mark McGough, the man who single-handedly invented the word fap. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to today's Captain's Blog. It's 1034 hours on October 14th, 2015, and I have the brake cartridges for this house top. The one to replace it, and one backup. I would like you to note, if you come here and use the saw because you're one of our awesome members, every time you set that damn thing off, it costs 70 bucks. Please do not set off the saw stop. It's not cheap. Ah, that, by the way, I think is number three and four for us sitting there right now. I know it's gone off twice so far. Ah, are my bins here yet? Ah, no bins, no bins, no bins, no bins. I need bins. There are no bins. Today's Captain's Blog is brought to you by Madman Mark McGough, the man who single-handedly invented the word FAP. Also, I would like to thank William, who donated 10 bucks on the Patreon. It broke. He's fixing it. Oh, okay. <sighs> so, not a lot of blog yesterday, because this. Look, there's resistors. Look at the size of those resistors and tell me that doesn't just turn you on. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Look at that. This is why we can't have nice things. So, yeah, we've got some big resistors and some damn big resistors. And then just some, some normal rationally sized resistors and different values. You can see the, the wire sizes and all that. We got a lot more of these and they'll start coming up here as they get sorted. But, clean shelves. Empty shelves and lots of them. And these are going to, they're going to get bins. Lots more bins. Bins of organization. It's like OCD porn in here today. And look at this, look at all these empty shelves. Oh my God, yeah. See, I had, this is all full of NSTs. And we did a big Zabutnik yesterday. Got all the NSTs moved downstairs. Um, because there's this is a filled in swimming pool so I can put fundamentally infinite weight here this is a concrete floor over a room building supply actually um, and I didn't want to have all the transformer weight built up there so I moved all the transformers downstairs where they're sitting on metal shelves in in built in building supply so I can put as much as I want on them and up here we'll put lighter things and bins are better so I'm putting bins up here Transformers down there. Let's get our tunes going. Because I can either shoot block all day or I can play tunes. And uh, what are we going to have? Let's start the day off with Dave Brubeck. Because otherwise I have to listen to their beeping all day long. So I'm going to rock with some uh, Dave Brubeck off the Time Out album. You guys have fun and I'll be back later. See ya. Again, we play our dangerous game.
Patrick. Fancy saw. Good morning, sir. Also, probably has something that'll tell me if it's on there. Which would be cool. That's for? Mm-hmm. Because, you know, if it's rubbing against the brick, brake, it's, uh, it doesn't look good. That Bellatini or the dog? Uh, I don't know. Could go either way. Right. The entire reset process done in less than five minutes. It spins the right way. It runs on 240, not 480. So, time is 18.51 hours, and Mackie says hi. And I've had a whole day of just sorting and cleaning and lots of meetings. I didn't get nearly as much done in there as I wanted. However, I had to show you this. We've been busy. This is just today. Today. 
Okay, so those are all envelopes with grant applications and proposals. How many are there? 48. This is, this is just today. So how many have we put out in the past month, like since we started? With these 48? Yeah. 503. 503? Uh-huh. Okay. And how many have you researched? <laughs> it's over a thousand. I know it's over a thousand. Yeah. I don't even know how many. For every but... one that we send out, I research like four. Yeah. So this and takes we, us up to 503. We choose not to apply to somebody if we just don't fit their qualifications. We're in the wrong geographic location. We don't deal with the right age bracket. We don't do medical. Just like cut yeah, and dry. There's, there's a million things. So <sighs> this is the grind. It's boring as hell, but this is how we grind. So cool. I'm going to go show them what I did in there, which isn't a whole lot. It's not nearly as impressive as the amount of work I put into it today. You have bins? I have, I have bins, and I have been filling bins. And I'm pretty sure the blog viewers are very bored with me and bins, but I have bins. This is today's batch of bins, what's left of them. And i got to turn the tunes off, so there. Oh, wow. Lou Reed in the Velvet Underground. Never knew. I gotta get a copy of that out. So, these shelves are... Come on, there you go. So, these are coming together. This pile is almost down to nothing. And there are a lot more things in bins. And bins here. These bins changed around a lot, but it doesn't really look like much. It's actually just... It really doesn't look like a lot. We did a lot in here today. Well, it doesn't look like it. Yesterday you had us all come in and move stuff. Yeah, and I showed him that. I showed him the empty shelves I started with. But it was like, oh, hey, look, insulators. Here's, here's some insulators. Here's some more insulators. Here's insulators with screws. Here's porcelain insulators. I mean, it's, it's not very exciting stuff, but it's, it's the grind of putting it all together. We sorted a lot of little nuts and bolts because we have special nuts and bolts just for high voltage, so we did a lot of sorting in that. And that's, that's very exciting stuff. But all of this is stock for you guys to come in when you're working in a high voltage lab and use and build stuff. So, 10 years from now, when you look at those shelves and you see all those nuts and bolts on it, and you come in and you need a quarter 20 brass bolt, and you know, it's right there, you'll, you'll know that this is when we did it. It's just been a day of grinding and having the world kick me in the balls and just, uh, Some days the only thing we can do is maintain the hope that there is hope. The dog is hopeful. We printed flyers. We printed flyers for Comic-Con. That's, that's a few. And that's nowhere near all of them. Today's trivia prize is tell me how many flyers there are in here. I'll give you a hint. It's an even number of an interval of ten. The dog knows. She does. Because she's watched the printer go. She counts. Dog does mad math. Did you, did you see what we did in sublimation today? No. That has been a one-man sublimation factory. These are all sublimated. Oh, I'm going on the wrong side. Mugs? Mugs. Two cases of mugs plus one or six over there. No princess? What? Oh, okay. And to go with it. Okay. Equal opportunity. That makes sense. And we've been printing. Great pleasure. <laughs> stuff. Cool. We have made so many magnets. These mugs are on our store. If you That's want one. That's freaky looking. I love that it comes with a mug for scale. With a mug for scale? So that's how big that is compared to the mug? Yes, which okay. means where... The brontosaurus doesn't have one. Brontosaurus doesn't have we have a couple where the mugs are like, the, the itsy bitsy. There's a mug. We, well, we, unfortunately, we came up with the mug idea at the end. So we don't oh, okay. Them, we need to update the design. There's several in the store that have been updated. Okay. 
the, the brontosaurus on the mug one is this tiny, tiny, like three pixel tall mug. Oh, okay. Hi. So that's a day. It was not a good day. It was, it was not a good day. It's Just, not the worst day. No, not even close to the worst day. But the hope is right there. That's, that's how we get from where we are to where we need to be. So if you get one of these envelopes in the mail in your office. Now, I've had a few of our viewers contact me and say they wanted information for their company. So if you think you, that your business might want to participate, let me know. I will help get you one of these packets in the mail. And we're doing this every day. Like, how, how many grant proposals had you submitted before you came into work today? Before I came into work Yeah, today? before you came here. Uh, four. Okay. I got to work at nine. Yeah. I know yesterday it was like seven, I think it was, or something yeah. like that. So, Sometimes yeah. I wake up at five, and by eight o'clock I would have submitted like 16. And those are the online ones. Yeah. yeah, so these these are people who said they wanted a, an actual paper proposal, but a lot of people just have a form you fill out online. I have filled out several hundred of those forms. It's thrilling work. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have fun. That's today's captain's blog. Tell, tell everybody bye. Today's Captain's Blog is brought to you by Madman Mark McGough, the man who single-handedly invented the word fat.